bringing you the best of the Jets, both on and off the field each week. We're going to kick the show off with a segment called Who Wore It Best. Now, Bree, the players are always trying to be super fashionable. Oh, yeah. But I'd like to take it back to the business trip to Nashville, which is what the name of this first look is called. Offensive guard Brian Winters really brought his A-game with this look. I love the traditional cowboy hat. Well, the second look is what's super interesting. Lloyd Christmas with the giant cowboy hat. Just in time for the holidays, he's got the 10 galener. Wrap that up and put it under your tree. <laughs> All right, Brie, between the two, who wore it best? I'm obviously gonna have to go with Lloyd Christmas on this one. Ah! Just when I think you couldn't possibly get any dumber, you go and do something like this and totally redeem yourself. On this segment of Helmets and Hashtags, Patriots Cordell Patterson got a little fancy with defensive lineman Henry Anderson. And let's just say Henry's fiance Saren was not too happy about it. Not at all. Hashtag, um, Henry is mine. And out of the 47 replies, because it did go viral, our favorite was from James reminding Saren, she better be nice from now on because Henry obviously has options. And despite Henry having options, this is what he had to say about Sam's tweet. Yeah, she's she's pretty safe. All right, it's time for our Jet Pet of the Week, and the winner is Bama the Lab. She enjoys snuggling, playing, eating sticks, and swimming. She's so cute. Congratulations, Bama. Send us your adorable pets and Jets gear using the hashtag Jet Pet for a chance to be featured on the show. Bree, have you ever heard of Sasquatch? No, but I've heard of Bigfoot. Ooh, and he goes by the name of Brent Qualley. No joke, we stumbled upon these during My Cause, My Cleats. And it's literally the size of a car. It's the size of my forearm. It's the size of Bree's shoulder to shoulder. It's a bird. It's a plane. No, it's Brent Qualley's cleats. We do appreciate the fact that you walk around with these every single day, and as well as play with them. But I feel bad for your wife, Melissa, at home, because if she has to trip over these every single day, Man, that, that's this would be going somewhere else. <laughs> All right, that's a wrap on this segment of No Pun Intended. We'll catch you next week.